What short-term financial goals do you have as a good motivator for saving and investing? What a fantastic question. Really digs into the nuts and bolts of why we scrimp, save, and try to think five moves ahead in life. Look, I've found from personal experience that short-term financial goals are like New Year's resolutions. They're a lot easier to stick to when they're concrete and achievable. Ambiguity is the enemy of motivation. So, here's what I do. There's a trio of short-term financial goals that I chase after. 1. Emergency fund top-up. It's like the financial airbag you hope you never need to deploy, but when life crashes into you, you'll be glad it's there. I'm here in Portland, Oregon, and let's be honest, it's not the cheapest city to live in. I make it a point to squirrel away a part of my paycheck to ensure I've got at least a three-month runway. It's not investing in the traditional sense, but boy, it's insurance against sleepless nights. 2. Vacation fund. Here's where I get to dream a little. I'm stowing away for a trip, not just any trip, mind you, a culinary tour through Italy or maybe exploring the frosty wonderland of Iceland. The key here is that it's designated and separate from my main savings. Knowing that every dollar saved is a step closer to that experience is motivation incarnate. 3. Learn by doing, investing. This is the fun one. I take a small sum, say a percentage of my monthly income, and actively invest it. I'm talking about ETFs, stocks, or even delving into the savagery of cryptocurrencies. But here's the kicker. This isn't retirement savings. It's play money, my learn the ropes fund. The goal is twofold. Education through real world experience and with some luck, a modest return that beats my savings account interest rate. These goals keep me grounded and forward thinking without making me feel like I'm shackling my present too tightly for a future that's not guaranteed. The key takeaway, make those goals tangible. Split them up. And remember, the journey should be as enjoyable as the destination. So, grab that metaphorical piggy bank, start tossing in the spare change, and watch those short-term goals pave the way to financial resilience. After all, isn't that what it's all about?